What's going on YouTube? This is your boy Charles here with Drink Clean Mobile Detailing and Pressure Washing. Uh, what we got set up, if you come take a look at this right here, um, is a singular hose from the tank to the pressure washer. Um, and what's the problem with this is, with these electric pressure washers, even with the gas ones, is that the pump has to work too hard to pull it and to push it out. So what we're doing now is, uh, I had a pump before, didn't really work out well. Um, I came across this pump from Harbor Freight. Um, they had two of them that we needed. Um, two of them that we could have got chose from. I choose this was the less expensive one. Um, and we're gonna set this up today and let y'all see how it works. So we'll be right back. In All a right, second. so what's up, guys? Right here is everything that you see. Is everything that we're gonna need. Um, this piece here actually does not come with the pump, but since the pump has two uh, male ends, you're gonna need this connector to connect to your hoses. Um, when you do the setup. So this right here, I got for about two, three bucks at uh, Home Depot this morning. So basically, man, it's real simple. I'm going to install this because sometimes we need extra water that we don't want to have to turn our pressure washer on for. We have an extra spout. So, go ahead. Oh, shit. I know a lot of details been going through this, man. We've been going through this. How long we been going through this? I'm talking to the cameraman. Ah, uh, about roughly about two years. <laughs> we've been going through about two years. <laughs> we've been buying these electric pressure washers, uh, any kind of pressure washer, really, over and over. So we're just trying to find something to help us save some money, man. Um, like I said, this is about $65 at Harbor Freight. Um, all my other setups seem to be working pretty well. Um, we haven't used this trailer much, but we're going to start. So, uh, yeah, so it's real simple. We're going to add. That's it. There. And then, like I said, this is where you need that female end and connect to these two male ends. Pop that off. Who needs that? All right. Connect to that end. straight to your pressure wash and this hose actually does come with this pump yes. so got an extra hose I'm gonna put the extra hose on there so if we ever need spare water we can just pour the water out there and we don't even have to touch that side set up so I'll be right back I'm gonna get some extension cords plug it up and uh, y'all see right, how it's up guys we back here we got everything set up for you um, as you see, if you hear the, the uh, pump turns on, we got the water on everywhere. So as soon as I hit this pressure washer, you'll see how strong it comes in. And I, I'm a kind of guy to where we like to park in certain positions and walk as far as we want. So we have like 100, 200 feet of hose sometimes. But we just need to make sure the pressure uh, stays constant. So they're going to pressure washer. So it, it'll stay consistent with that pump, constantly pulling and pushing for the pressure washer to deliver that constant pressure. So if you guys are looking for something that a uh, couple last year, a pressure washer's going to run from your tank, Harbor Freight is where it is. Peace. Hey.